Uh, back in shape, Maine's famous spinning ice disc says hello. Officials discourage anyone from attempting to go out on the ice. Quote, unquote, it is not safe. Don't tell me <laughs> my life. Don't, no, you don't make decisions for me. The Westbrook ice dick, the ice dick has returned to the... <laughs> no, that would be something I would not ride. This entire caption is a fucking tongue twister, okay? The Westbrook ice disc has returned to the Presumpscot River below Sakarapa Falls Tuesday, January 11th, 2022 in Westbrook, Maine. Wow. Sakarapa. Sakarapa Falls. Exactly, Serenity. If it, you know what? If it looks fun, give it a shot. Yeah. So basically the way these things form is that they break off and it keeps bumping around. And just gain speed. Right. It gains speed and it bumps around and it, and it kind of it whittles it down slowly into a circle. Nice. It's pretty cool. Uh, the disc has begun. Begun. Begun? Why is it? G Christ, bro. You okay? Begun. <laughs> I have not yet begun to form. And the Presumpscot River, where it partially formed in 2020, but failed to draw a worldwide audience like it has in its first appearance in 2019. I'm sorry. I just... <laughs> <laughs> said the disc has become, and I'm, the first thing that ran through my head was the dick has pre come. The dick has pre, <laughs> the dick has pre come to form in the Persumscot River. <laughs> I can't English right now. Uh, Westbrook city officials shared photos of the formation Wednesday on Facebook, encouraging residents to share more images of the disc while it's still around. Make us famous. That's right. Ice discs form as a result of current and vortex under the ice. Ice sheets begin to spin and then form into circles, but ice discs largely really form in locations like Westbrook. City officials discourage anyone from attempting to go out on the ice. What makes it not safe? Is it thin? Is it, yeah. is it spinning? I think it's because it's thin. Uh, three years ago, a hundred yard wide ice formation appeared in the river for the first time and brought international attention to Westbrook before it dissipated with the advent of warmer weather, as ice does. You would think, right? I mean, my drinks that get warm tell me that that's how ice melts. You know, ice get hot, ice turn water. Ice get water get cold, water turn ice. Uh, and it's this cycle. Okay. So, you know who Hank Green is, right? Mm hmm Okay, so, he had this video not too long ago talking about ice and water and things like that. And it's, is, like, one of the questions was, is ice a rock? Technically, it is. by the definition of a rock... Ice is classified as a rock, and by that classification, does that mean since lava can since lava is melted rock, does that mean that ice melted, aka water, is lava? Technically, water is lava. Yeah, based on our based on our definitions. Yeah, totally. Yes, and then if that makes that true, that means I'm ninety percent lava, making me a lava monster. We are lava monsters. Welcome, welcome, my son. Welcome. To the machine. Uh, yeah, we we are lava beasts. This is great. 